Hey guys, so today I want to do a quick little benchmark speed test comparison here between the iPhone 6 and the Goofone i6. So uh, you can use Geekbench 3 here on these two devices. So you can kind of see here um, only a half gigabyte here memory, uh, one gigabyte here, dual core but 4 gigahertz Apple A8 versus the MT6582 quad core like 1.3 GHz I'm pretty sure it is. Uh, so let's do this here. You can see that this test runs way faster here on the iPhone 6, which is interesting. Uh, so already we have the score here on the iPhone. Of course, there are different platforms. I mean iOS versus Android The app might uh, be differ differ a little bit uh, But you can see here a single core score here is 1632 here on the iPhone 6 and multi-core is uh, Kind of like like double there as it should be Now we just have to wait here for the uh, the Goofone i6 to finish up. Sixty-five percent. So uh, clearly, as you can see, it's definitely slower on the Goofone. Soon finished here on the go phone. Da, 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 da. So the score here is a. I mean, you can see that the iPhone is way faster. Um, of course, the single core score here is way lower here uh, than the single core score here. But the thing is that we do have four different cores. Uh, on the Goo phone, so you can see that uh, this one seems to be around three times as fast, I guess, uh, when you add up that multi core score. So, that can definitely be some interesting stuff there. Uh, it could be good there to know. So, I mean, the iPhone cost, the iPhone 6 cost around six times as much. Uh, so, it's still pretty good, I mean, from the Goo phone. I mean, if you look at it from price, you're not going to get an iPhone uh, that cheap with good performance, probably, uh, on the latest iOS. But it flows pretty well here on the Goo phone. So yeah, quickly look there with the Geekbench 3 app.